You often come across charts in image form from which you need to extract data points either for data driven modeling or comparative study. For example, this is an image file which shows the stress strain curve of aluminium and steel. And now from here you need to ex extract data points so that you can do some further analysis. Now to do this, you can use one of the file exchange called Grabit which lets you extract data points of image files. If you want to download it from the file exchange, you can go through the link which we have provided in the description or you can also add it in MATLAB through add-ons. Let's see how to add it in MATLAB using add-ons. To open MATLAB, you need to click on the add-ons, then click on the get add-ons, then in the search box, type Grabit to search for the Grabit file exchange entry. So here it is. Now you can add it or download it. Once you have added Grabit in MATLAB, you'll find this file in the folder. Once you open this file, and run this and user interface will open up. Now the first task is to load the image. So we'll click on the load image tab and we'll load the stress strain curve. Now you can see the image. Next you have to calibrate it. So for that we will click on the calibrate button. Then we need to select the minimum and maximum value for X and Y axis. So first task let's Select the minimum value for x axis, which will keep it as 0. Then maximum value for x, which will keep it as 0 0.25. Then minimum value for y, 0. And maximum value for y, that is 350. Now you can see that whatever values we have defined for x and y axis, those are visible over here. Now let's click on the line to grab the points. So first, we'll grab the points for aluminium. So for that, click on the grab points tab, then start grabbing the points. So you can see that once you start grabbing the points, these extracted data points are visible in the preview box. Once you have grabbed all the points, then press enter. Now you can see that the data has been extracted. So you can go ahead and rename it. So we will name it as data aluminium. Similarly, if you want to extract data for steel, you can go ahead and click on the grab points. And again, you need to click on the line to grab the data point for steel. So following the same procedure, we have extracted data for steel. Now these extracted points for aluminium and steel can be seen in the workspace. So if you double click, you can see the data points similarly for steel as well. Now further to verify, we have written a MATLAB code which will plot the stress strain curve for aluminium and steel. So let's run it. Now when you run this, you can see that we are getting the similar result. So now once you know the procedure to extract the data points, you can go ahead with your different images and extract the data points. Thank you.